Welcome, Welcome to, to the, the Drunken Bear. Bear. Hello, Bear Squad. Hello. We're lucky enough today to get heaps of Malaysian snacks. So many. We got heaps of treats, and it's courtesy of a lovely subscriber called Tiffany. So thank you so much, Tiffany. Um, she's a local here in Kuala Lumpur, and she's given us heaps of Malaysian childhood snacks mm. for us to try. Yeah. So there is another guest who is Wally. Oh, Wally. From Wally the Wombat. Australia. Yeah. What's the first pick? Okay, first pick. Let's go with these. They look cute. They look cute. Okay. Tiffany wrote all these um, little notes mm. on the snacks. So thoughtful. Look at this. All the snacks have little notes. Yeah. So that one is called... Yim. Yum yum. Yum yum. 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 Let's taste so it. Cute. Oh, it's like a dipping thing. Look at that. It looks so Ooh. good. Yeah. That that's not what I expected. Yeah, that's. It comes with uh, a little spoon uh, uh, thing. Uh, that's. Look that's at that. So cute. How do, how does it work? Do you like? Looks like you can scoop them up like that. Hmm. It tastes like rice bubbles. Yeah, I don't know. Is, is it? Is it? Is it literally just one by one? Because oh. it looks like a one rice can fit in in this <laughs> yeah. spoon. Oh, oh and no. your one rice fell. One rice fell to Wally. It's like a teething. The chocolate tastes like a Nutella. Hey, That's very yummy though. It's too yummy. But it's, it's really good, but I just don't know how to do it. It's so yummy, but it's too... Maybe you're supposed to mix it in. Mm. Ah! Oh, I think you Ooh. got it. Did you get it right? Maybe mix the whole thing? Maybe mix it in. Like this. Anyway, that's a bit more success. <gasps> Maybe do that! Uh, that makes sense. You dip it in the chocolate and then you do that. I think that's what, how it is. Mmm. Okay. Mm. It's so good. First one was a success straight away. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I think that's how it works. Mm. Okay, I, th I think we got it. Mm. Yum, yum. It yum, yum. That was yum, yum. Okay, this next one. Cure cough <laughs> candy. Old Sorry. school. Mm. It's an old school one and it's called... I reckon that's just a really weird looking... It does look like medicine, actually. Don't you think? No, it's, it's got a medicine looking... Uh, it's like... Um, what is it? Um, Strepsils? Strepsils, yeah. Mm. Okay, let's open this one up. Mm, yum, yum, yum. Mm. A bit worrisome. Mm. It's like a cough lolly. Mm. But the flavour's a bit different. More strong. It's more got like a licorice kind of flavor, doesn't it? More Chinese medicine. Mmm. Mmm. It's a really copper rolling because um, um, I can really feel is. my tongue, my nose, they are kind of like opening now. That's true. Mm, mm. Okay. The next one. Okay, this one is that. Horse legs. GG. Four flakes. Oh, this one. It doesn't look like a cookie. Four flakes. I have no idea. I can't tell if it's a lolly, if it's a cookie. Because the thing is, and she wrote those thoughtful notes, but then some cookies, while we are touching them, um, <laughs> they off. lost to those notes. notes. So, um, I have no idea. Okay, I got this one. Huh? Look at that. Several things in there. It's not overpowering smell. Okay. I'm gonna put it. I'm scared now. Mm? Mm? It's not the consistency I thought it was gonna be. Jujubu. Don't you think? Hmm? It's jujubu. I don't know what that is. I haven't had this fruit. In Korea we have this, but if if this is that fruit. We mm. have that fruit, but I haven't had it in Australia like for many years. So um, <clears throat> I'm not exactly sure if that's the flavor, but it, it tastes like a, that fruit. I'll, mm. I'll show you the picture. Just well, the ingredients say whole water sugar. So the ingredient is whole, whatever H-A-W is. How, whole, I don't know how to pronounce it. That was a lot better than I thought it was going to be. It didn't look appetizing, but that was really yummy. It was nice. I love it. Okay, so far, nothing's been something I don't like. It looks like a noodle. 
<laughs> Noodle sticks kind of thing. Well, look at it. It's got a cat playing electric guitar on the front. How can you go wrong? No. Oh. Okay. Mimi. Mimi. Snickle. That's cute. Mimi. Okay. Mmm. These are good. These are my favourite so far. Kind of like a pretzel, but it's yummier than that. It's like it's a like rice. Oh, prawn. Prawn flavoured snacks. That's what it's oh. It's really yummy. I really like this one. Let us know if you used to have these as a kid or if you still have them. Mm. Quite I'm nice. wondering. That's a good one. Okay. Plum candy in slice. Okay, this is interesting. Edibi. Edibi. Okay, dried. Actually, this is dried guava. This one. <laughs> dried guava. Real fruit chips. Ah, uh, plum candy must be a different one. I, I think, think it's that one. Mm. I don't think I have. I've tasted guava drinks before, but I've never actually tasted the actual fruit. So, and I'm not a fan usually of dried fruit, except for the dried mangoes. I really, really love those mango. Um, I forget what they're called, but mm. they're like dried mangoes. I yeah, love them. the oh. Filipino dry mangoes. Yeah, the Filipino dry mangoes. Yeah. Oh my god, I love them. I'm so addicted to them. Okay, it might be the similar to this. Mm. My tongue is very refreshing because oh. of that. After the hacks. Because <laughs> that's the hack. <laughs> that's a good name for it. Mm. This is really yummy. Mm. It's a bit like the dried mango yeah, one. Yeah, but dried mango one. It's a different flavour, but I really like that. Mm. Okay. So mm. far, nothing really scary to foreign. Um, mm. It all have been great. For me, anyway. There's a plum one. Plum tablet candy. Mm. And it says Bigfoot on it. That's a bit weird, but... Enriched with vitamin C. Okay. Traditionally formulated plum tablet candy. That does look a bit odd. Okay. A bit different to what I thought it was oh, going to be. Oh, this one. Mm. I hope this doesn't have that much plum because I, I do remember that I think I'm allergic to plum. That's true. Mm. I think I'm allergic to plum. A bit worried. But I'm sure it's fine. Look at this one. This is super cute. Maltese. Maltese. Look at that! That's just the cutest little packet! Love that one! Mm. He's on a skateboard, Maltese. Maltese. This kind of reminds me of the video that I made with a guy who lives in Gibraltar. Um, mm. I will link that video here. Um, yeah, that was really fun yeah. to try all these different snacks from Gibraltar. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So, okay. It's like a boroka. Yeah. I'm wondering if we should be eating these or dipping them into something. <laughs> Two foreigners. No. No, it's not. It says Bali. Mm. 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 Okay. Even the ones that don't look appetizing and looks like really, I don't know, they've all actually turned out pretty yummy. It's actually very yummy. It tastes like um, the malt drinks. Mm. It's just the normal malt, but it's just because the look look was a bit like a drug-like. Mm. Yeah, it just like. it looked a bit like like a Barocca, something you got to drop in a drink for it to go fizzy. That's that's why I was worried that it yeah, was yeah, for yeah, a drink. Yeah, me but too. That's actually really yummy. But actually, yeah, that was just the, the look. Uh, prepared cuttlefish, best selected quality. You might be scared of this. This one, one I'm scared of. Look at it. How can you not be scared? <laughs> no. I see these snacks a lot in like um, Asian groceries, and you see them. There's a lot of them. Like, so it must be really popular to eat. Um, anything squid-like, octopus, any of that terrifies me. I love them. It really does terrify me. I love them. I don't know why. Mm. Mm. Really, really love just that. Just the concept just scares me. Uh, is that great for alcohol? I think I need to be drunk to eat it. No, that, that's not the reason we eat this one. <laughs> How do you open it? You're opening it right? Ah, oh, there was something all along. It was stupid. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, well, Please. it smells intense. I love it. It smells. Though. I love it. Look at this. Take it out of the tray. I'm already eating it, though. You're already eating it. Wow. Okay, that's quick. It's yummy. Mmm. It's good. Chewy. Mm. He hates the chewy food. Mm. I love it. Okay. Nah, that one's not for me. No? No. Nah. Too fishy, that one. I love it. I can see that people would like it, though. Mm. But it's got a bit of spiciness to it. Mm, it's good. Good with the beer. Mm. The kai's work. Mm. Mm. Okay, yeah, that's the first one I... Didn't really like me. I, like I didn't it. hate it, surprisingly. I thought I was going to hate it, but. Classic West Yeah. Mm. Here we go. Mm. Oh, it's oh. really pinky. Yum. So, this is a pump. Do you know what? I might probably not going to have this one for me. Yeah, because. Just because I'm allergic to plums, so I'm not going to kill myself for this video. What's it like? Chewy by the sounds of it. Mm. Too intense. I feel like I'm having like a 10 plums at the same time. Mm. So sour. Okay, we're on to another one. We've got a few more left here. White rabbit candy. And this is another old school snack, apparently. I feel like this is going to take like, uh, what are they called? Oh. Milky or something? Mm. Is it, am I eating the right thing or the paper is in there? I think you just eat that paper. Is it? Are you eating that paper? I'm like, fine with well. eating a bit of paper. Mm. Mm. Very chewy. Milky. Mm. White rabbit. Hold it. Mm. Here we go. Mm. White rabbit. Cool man. Mm. Just milk candy. Not much flavour that one. This is an interesting one. Hopefully, it didn't come with instructions this one, or we lost the instructions for it, but mm. this one looks like the weirdest one that we could have. That smells intense, and that's that's a strange snack. Is this one tea? I don't think so. It seems very chewy. Is it Dorian? It stinks a lot. This is really odd. I don't know if we're even supposed to be eating this or drinking it or what. It's a bit of a beef jerky kind of taste to it. Bitter too. Don't you think it's bitter? I don't even know if we should be eating this. That's it. I'm, I'm not a fan of this. I don't know. Maybe we're doing that one wrong. Not really a fan of this. Yeah. That was a really weird one. Let us know if you've ever tried that one. Mm. Is if it it's favorite? even, is it even food? <laughs> Are we having this completely wrong and we're eating like a tea bag? Something as silly as that. That's quite possible. I don't think this is a tea. I think this is snack. But I just... This is a, such a foreign food. That is, that's the ultimate that's foreign food. That's very exotic. Um, <laughs> that is, that's very interesting. It wasn't uh, terrible though. It was yeah. like a bit of beef jerky kind of taste to it, I thought. Saying this unique as a Korean who is mm. Asian too. Mm. That is a very Malaysian, I'll say. Yeah, that's that's unique. But very, very surprisingly, unique. I preferred this over the squid. So that's No, nah, no, nah, squid. I uh, give me squid nah, I'm again. No, I'm serious. I'd rather that give one. Give me squid again. Nah, there you go. There's the squid. <laughs> 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 you finished that squid. Yeah. Okay, we've got these ones. Peanut crackers. Mm -hmm. mm, it's good. That's a good one. This Easy is a good one. one. This Fast one. Snack. Very similar to the peanut um, snacks you can get in Australia mm -hmm. because a lot of um, Australians eat those kind of um, salted peanuts but the ones that have a bit more of a curry based flavour to it so that's getting quite popular so they're really yummy. It's good. There's another one here. Poppadoms. That one there. Mm. Indian lentil snack. Easy peasy. Easy. And 
I've really enjoyed the Indian food here in KL. It's been just absolutely unbelievable. So Very yummy. Mm. Mm. We tried the roti chennai, not with the te tarik, but we tried it by itself and it was so, so yummy. It was so yummy. Mm. Really good. Yeah, I mm. loved it. Mm. So this has been our Malaysian taste test. Thank you so much to Tiffany, um, local KL person who has given us all these snacks to try. We never would have found these snacks if it wasn't for you, Tiffany. So thank you so much. So make sure to subscribe, hit the subscribe button to watch um, more of our videos for Kuala Lumpur, but also for around the world, because we're just traveling everywhere. Yeah, for now we are um, planning to upload at least about 20 videos of uh, Malaysia. Mm. So lots of videos are on the way. Lots of videos. Stay tuned. And we will see you next time. Bye. Bye, guys. See ya.